All right, so this is problem number four in section 9.1. A few things that we want to take into consideration uh, when completing this problem is that the radius is perpendicular to a tangent line, meaning that they intersect at 90 degree angles. Also, uh, we need to come up with an equation of the line. In this particular problem, what we need is to, we need the slope of a line and that would be rise over run and we also need to know that the slope of a line perpendicular is opposite and reciprocal and then what equation of a line are we going to use in this for this particular problem the one that we're going to use is a point slope formula meaning that we need a point and the slope of the line. Uh, here's a point that we want to use there. And so let's go ahead and begin this problem. So first let's find us, uh, let's go ahead and draw in the radius from point P to point A. Now the radius itself has a slope, so the slope of the radius is rise over run. We went up nine units and they went to the right or our run is three that means that the rate that the slope of the radius is three over one slope perpendicular to the radius would be opposite and reciprocal so instead of three over one is one over three uh, the point that we're going to use is point a point a's coordinates are at three nine uh, let's go ahead and write down the formula for point slope. That would be y minus y sub 1 is equal to m, our slope, times the quantity x minus x sub 1. Uh, we are going to do substitution in three different places, y sub 1, m, and x sub 1. And here we go. So what we have is y minus y sub 1 is 9 is equal to a negative 1 third times the quantity x minus x sub 1 is 3. What we have to do now is distribute this negative 1 third to everything inside of the parentheses. 9, y minus 9 is equal to a negative 1 third x plus 1. The last thing to do is to add 9 to each side so we can solve for y. Our final answer is y is equal to negative 1 third x plus 10. And there we have it. That's the equation of the tangent line.